Pakistan v India is always a very, very special occasion. We're at the Hagley Oval in Christchurch for the second semi-final of the ICC Under-19 World Cup. Do the honours, please. Tails call. Tails is the call? Tails, it's India. It is a tail. You've won the toss. But V, what are you going to do? Oh, we're going to bat first. Indian team into the centre. Manjot Kalra, he's had a good outing in this World Cup, an average of 52. And the man at the other end, the captain of the under-19 Indian team, Prithvi Shaw. Ashad Iqbal with the uh, new ball. Up and over, and plenty of the middle of the bat. Perfect. If you're not moving your feet, that's exactly the ball you want. Short and swatted away for a boundary. Up and over. Beautiful swing of the bat. A gift. And put away. Oh, it's costly. Not just uh, the boundary, which was a, a beautiful shot again. Another example of his uh, strength through the offside. But I'm afraid uh, it's a no ball, so there's going to be a free hit as well. Sliced away, and we'll get a boundary. In the air again, but hit beautifully. So just a little bit of width. You only have two men outside the circle and uh, one of them isn't at deep point. Lovely shot. Oh no, another one. Two in a row. Run out, now a chance in the slips has been put down. Up and over. Talk about timing. And would you believe it? Zayed has put down another chance at slip. Oh, this is hit well. Hit very well indeed. And that's the first maximum all the way. Oh, and there was nearly a, a chop on from an inside edge, just squeezing past off stump. Could be tight, could be tight again. <laughs> That'll go upstairs. Oh, this is going to be tight. It's a good dive. Whether well, his bat's in the air, that's the problem. Has it bounced? Yep. So at the fourth time of trying to run out one of these openers, it's finally happened. And uh, Prithvi Shaw is the man gone. Good work from Musa, the bowler. Shaw goes for 41, 89 for one. In a three, Shipman Gill. He's a good player, Shimon Gill, in good form. Got him! Excellent bowling from uh, this strong, young cricketer. Gets it through. And that is the end of Manjot. Manjot Kaura goes for a well-made 47, 94 for two. India's wicketkeeper in at four. Harvick Desai. Smashed away for four, not far away from mid wicket. Yeah, wondering when it was going to happen. And there it is. Gill is on the charge. And there is that delightful use of the feet. And gone, sharp catch. Couldn't quite get it down. I don't think he even tried to get it down. Uh, just playing through the shot. Finds the man at point. So, uh, so desperately needed the breakthrough. So, the side goes for a world compiled 20. It's now 148 for three. Rian then in at uh, number five. Edged and out. Caught behind, just loose outside that off stump. So Pakistan are clawing their way back into this contest.
Absolutely. Another good decision. Keep with Arshad. Brought him back into the attack. He rewarded the captain with the wicket. And now he's got a second. Brian goes for two. 156 for four now. Abhishek, he impressed uh, all of us that watched the game, uh, the quarter final, that is. There's a great example. Square man deep on the leg side, but certainly no one behind square. There's a big appeal, <laughs> and that could be out. Caught down the leg side. And uh, the umpires have called for drinks, and what a time for Pakistan to celebrate. Number five down for India. Abhishek for five. 166 for five now. And a call Roy with a, a chance to bat for some overs. 50 up. What a 50 it's been under great control for Shubh Mangil. He's been uh, one of their star players throughout the tournament. Oh, shot. Smash straight. Oh, that is just so cheeky. Oh, width. He's just thrown everything at that. Oh, again, just width. Not quite found the middle of the bat. Gonna race away, though. Oh, just brilliant hands. Wherever you put the field, they're managing to just find it. That'll be four. Cleared the man at mid-wicket. <laughs> Batsman walked. Good pace, 145. Dug in. Perfect line right over that right shoulder. So the batsman had no room to move. It's the end of a good innings from Roy. He goes for 33. It's 233 for six. Kamlesh Nagar is the new batsman. Oh, good sound. Solid shot. Inside edge onto the stumps. An excellent over. Back of the length. Cramping Nagar Kotti in it. Just coming off. Inside edge. Body. Then stump. So he goes for one off six deliveries. It's 242 for seven. Mavi in at nine. That's beautifully played by Mavi. Gets that away into the gap as well. Back to back boundaries for Mavi. Out straight to mid wicket. Mavi's gone. Marvi goes for a quick fire 10. It's 265 for eight. Shiver is in a 10. A superbly bold, superbly bold. Another wicket for Musa. He has been brilliant with his wicket taking ability. Four wickets to him. Shiver goes for one. It's 267 for nine. Nishan Porel on strike. Chance for a run out and misses again. No one got to the stumps to cover it. Oh, no ball. It will be dropped down there as well. Wouldn't have mattered the catch. Allows them to come back for two. And the confirmation of a real batting talent for India. Shubman Gill gets to India's first hundred in this tournament. It's gone high. It's Good gone start. down towards it sure. long off again. Strong again at the top and of the he order. Holds on. Run out for 41. Hassan Khan, Good. the captain. Had a couple of chances. Made his way to 47. Finishes so good partnership up front. But then the standout. It was Gill. 71. He navigated the whole innings and did it with sure. great style. Was strong again at the Ended top of the order. The well run out for 41. Manjot looked good. But then the standout. It was Gill. 4 for 67 for Musa. He was able to find penetration in in nine conditions. Three wickets for Ashad as well. He took key wickets through the middle phase of the innings. Three for 51. Pakistan will need to go on average just under five and a half per over if they are to get it. Imran Shah. 
Mavi then. Shivan Mavi. It's great to see. Great to see not just uh, perhaps what we come to expect from subcontinent batsmen. Very skillful, very wristy, very effective. Complement each other pretty well, these two opening bowlers. Well, he's going to have a go, and he's a very good shot. Picked up, and what a catch, what a brilliant catch, just for a moment. He thought it might have been sailing over his head. Well, this time he hits it well, watched it all the way, and then just doesn't get it over the cushion. Presence of mind to know exactly where he was. Zaida Lamb goes for seven, ten for one. Early wicket then brings Rahel Nazir to the crease. Runs in the tournament so far. Gone. What a catch. Good field placement as well. He's just gone. Yeah, he's delighted the captain. You feel you're earning your money. That is excellent. Captaincy, brilliant bowling as well. Just a dive to his left. It was a good catch in height. All in round. Shah goes for two. 13 for two. Q Ali Zariab, who's the leading run scorer for Pakistan in the competition. Is this out as well? You better believe it. And the captain has got another one. Because it was hit well enough. That is sharp. And catch number two for Prithvi Shaw. Zariab goes for one, 20 for three. And at number five, Ahmed Allen. Up in the air, is it safe? No, it's not. It's the fourth wicket falling at 28. Tough, tough mountain to climb now. Simple catch for Mavi. Alam goes for four. 28 for four. Muhammad Taha. The lefty in. Out. Looking for that boundary and getting an outside edge and presenting a very, very simple catch. Shiva Singh pitched up delivery. Tried to get underneath that. Managed to scoop an easy catch to Kamlesh Nagarkoti, who rarely misses an opportunity. Taha gone for four. Pakistan. 37 for 5. So coming at number 7 is Saad Khan. Struck high and this could well be caught. It is. Riyan Parag, the second opportunity in the same over. Gets it way down on the toe of the bat. Went high. Had to decide whether he runs back or does he pedal back. Shubman Gill. Nice catch to follow up, 100. Pakistan, spot of real bother, 41 for 6. Hassan Khan has come to the crease. In the air, and this could be caught again. Brilliant catch. Who is it? Take one guess, it's Mr. Gill. Second wicket for Rian. Well, this is a lot harder catch. Brilliant, had to turn behind himself, remain balanced. And look at that, why not? Yes, Hassan Khan goes for one, it's 45 for seven. Well, the big quick, Shahin Shah has come. Well, well, well. Well, it's a wicket. It was like a, just a leg spinner, really, as much as anything. Not a carom ball or anything like that. He swings and his follow through and he's off. He goes for naught from 11.48 for eight. Mohammed Musa, he went for a few runs, but he picked up four wickets. That's high. Struck it well enough to get over mid on. And four. Gone for six. Oh. They'll go upstairs. Does well to actually get back. Foot's in the air, done. From the position he was in, he did well to just get any sort of movement back, but he's not quick enough. Well, one to go, it's going to be. 
Sad car now goes for 15, 68 for nine. Last man to the crease. Heaved away, man in the deep, comes in and finishes it off nicely. What a terrific performance by India. In truth, they've been far too good today for Pakistan. So summary of uh, what we've seen in the last few hours.